time possible as Pike oh. is going to be locked in for Carrier. This is a dangerous lane now. On the red side as well is actually crazy. We've seen her priority skyrocket, yeah. especially on the 10-16 patch. So sort of just flew under the radar for the majority of this draft. Looking for it. They will be able to get a stun as there it goes. Now Nogri underneath the turret. Watch out. Eep going to be flashed. Turning up towards the top side, he does have that Lilting Lullaby available. Oh. There's the Ornhorn from Nogri. Does get the knockup on uh -oh. Goshik, but miss it, misses the headbutt. To crack down the mid-tier one of DRX here. And this should be a really good fight for Damwon if it unfolds. Mode, yeah, he's actually going to... And there is poke on both sides. Now the curtain call comes in. Showmaker going to get tagged, but there's the Ornhorn. That's going to interrupt uh -oh. them immediately. The Renekton's going to fall first blood. Going over to Canyon at 20 oh! minutes in this game as Trophy finds the back Trophy? line. He's going to tag Ghost, but he gets exhausted and immediately scattered out of that return. Taken down with just a headshot from the Caitlyn and DRX are forced to scatter. This is the dumb one we're expecting. I, put, I, the I mean, Nogri solo zoned him from this whole team. Yeah. First he interrupts his ultimate. And then he says, no, Dev, you're not allowed to play the game. Akali. I'm gonna go forward. I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm doing my own thing. <laughs> Vision going to be here for Dom 1. They should get first mention as Goshik. Able to dodge out of the final spark. Doran getting in here as Chovy finds the backline canyon. Down to about half health. Wilting Lullaby is going to get some work done as Beryl. Going to flash out of the way, but he's going to survive. No, Chovy gets on in there, but he'll be taken down. Only able to trade that one for oh. one. And now Noggery oh. with the turnaround, but misses the second shot. Carrier barely able to absorb the ace in the hole for Dev. Just the curtain call comes in and Noggery says, yeah, you got any more? Damo Gaming has Ord ulti, so if they fail to engage, Damo Gaming is going to just re-engage simply. Oh, oh Chovy? Oh, yeah, Chovy is teleported in through the backside, throws down the control ward. Oh, now Damon all what? grouped up. Chovy no! he gets immediately exhausted. He's into the shroud. He survived for now. And remember, he does have that Zonyas as well. Looks like DRX has... Oh! oh, there it is. oh my god. There's Oralty. Okay. Gary is going to get out of there. Oh. The knockup is only going to land, but there is the slice out from Doran. Um, well, he just wanted to make sure that the button worked, I guess. No engage. There are so many traps. Yeah. DRX can't get in. They're thinking about whether they want to be flashing over walls or anything like that. Pyrrhic does not have his available at this point in time. And that's going to be the Baron just freely taken by Damwon. This Caitlyn is so incredibly scary. Ghost is going to flash on forward immediately. Oh! He's just eviscerated. Ghost flashing oh! after death. But Trovi might be able to take him down. And the Renekton is going to be able to do it. But he will fall. And now Trovi basically by himself. But it is 3v3. The health bar advantage is well and truly there for Damwon, though. And oh, they got Chovy! Looking like they have too many opportunities. Azonya's going to keep Chovy alive for the moment. But or Skewer puts on back in position to try and fight against Chovy. The backflip comes through, and they just can't touch him. They can't. They're too tanky. They cannot kill Orn at all. And also, even Volibear is looking really strong. And they have no jungler oh, right now. No. They have no jungler. Well, they're trying to get Canyon out of there. He's stunned up as well. It's a good knockup on the carrier who does get himself out of the way with his dash. Chovy? So Drake still taking a lot oh, of damage to get Barrel. Okay, not going to... ...position right now, so they decide to just go on the front. Yep, that's what they're going to do, and the Renekton's going to have to slither his way all the way over here. The carrier is waiting for him, but this tower just evaporates. Yoshi going to go golden. Oh, that's the Unleashed power, and I think Pike is basically dead off to the side. As Lily is going to be taken down, Death going to be chunked for half of his health bar by one auto attack from Ghost than this, uh, this number would actually say. They're looking for N. Well, let's see whether Doran can actually get anything done. He does get onto Ghost, who nets, flashes, gets himself out of there. The uh, Renekton, too much. Not going to do anything more as Chovy's going to get exhausted. Can he be the hero? The answer is going to be no as all. Backflip, oh! it looks for Canyon. Goes Golden, there's the curtain call. But the tanky members are just too tanky. Another Unleashed Power from Showmaker says goodnight to Carrier. And Deft is going to have to chill out on this fountain. Just wait for game number two as Dom one come out swinging in game one. Well, that was definitely a bit of a, a tippy in the drippy is uh, what ended up <laughs> happening at one point inside of this game. That was a masterclass on Akali versus Syndra. Chovy 
dominated laning phase in EXP and CS. Renekton so far ahead of the Orn. Two level gap inside of the jungle. What more do people need to see out of a draft in terms of gaps that were present? All the champions that DRX has right now is really bad into Syndra, it feels like. Yeah. So they, they countered themselves. They, I feel like they're just endlessly walking headfirst into Dom Juan's champions. Oh, here we go. Alistar coming out for Barrel. Canyon knows. Um, As Carrier moves on over. The Ignite's already down. Face Break is going to miss, and Canyon's just toying. Oh, I think he's just trying to try to get the what, what Okay, there's a dive top oh, side God. as well as no. Doran's oh, trying man. to hold oh, on to no. the turret aggro. But uh, that was a bad move. Showmaker now finds himself in an odd position as first one goes over to Chobi. Double? He even crab raves as he picks up the double kill. And now Beryl's going to get dove on also. He has to flash to get to the Blasco. You're not a champion that ever wants to be behind, and you have a very hard time coming back. Well, there's the, there's the flash forward, and this is what this combo is designed to do. Again. Okay. Well, it's going to come down here as Death in a whole host of trouble. Headbutted into the wall. Oh. Very, very dead as now Pyoshik. Trying to get some work done. Oh. Face breaker defensively from Carrier. Far ahead. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh, no which, flash. He's going to be able to get the stun. Ooh. Tanking up the turret now, but Trovi will survive. Kira is dead. What? I mean, he should know it. Nuggery. Well, Ulti's going to start it up. Gets the stun there as well onto Nuggery, who's going to try and fight this one back out. Does have a dice available. Oh. Bowling ball going to be no. avoided by it. He has no flash. He's no. waiting for that slice to come back off cooldown. I have a feeling he's not oh. going to survive, but he lost. Super Soaker goes out. Good stun there onto uh -oh. Uh -oh. Yoshik, but it's not oh. going to quite be enough. The set going to go down, and Fates calls one hell of a snowball because Nasher is off. Oh. There's a headbutt pulverize, as immediately goes oh, all back to the cow, whip. but they miss it. Oh no, now Ghost is going to get booped around. The Ren did a fair bit of work, but the Lily is going to shut them down. The cow oh. also going to be. No! Oh, 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 the Ezreal and Nogari's oh. flashing on top of everyone. Good night, Lilia. As Doran's gonna flash the hell away. That was, of course, out of fear. Out poking Jace and Ezreal. Huh? Over Beryl? goes Beryl. He's looking for more. The Fates Call is going to come in as the Showstopper went down as well. Nogari oh. take down the turret as the Nidalee's going to secure the set. Now Joby gonna boot back that Nid. And Damwon are on the run. It Pop is it. currently two for one in favor. Ariel has Hex Flash, by the way. Oh, such a great position. You can see it, but it is going to be the Ren that oh. will down. Now the team fight. Meryl looking for a pulverized target. Carrier is going to go down first. Oh. Yoshik now in trouble. There's and, nothing Toby uh, can do. Yeah, we're going to punch the ground a little bit, but that's just because Doran's angry and Deft is standing in the back of this pit, just hoping that it is all over. Toby gets one. He's trying. I mean, his KDA <laughs> looks great this game, but I mean, other he's than really that, trying. it's all awful. Well, Godby is, well, not the player, but... <laughs> <that Wayless? laughs> yeah. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, no. No, like this. Shut not down. Like this. Ocean Souls, by the way, for Dom. Yeah. It's an ocean of holy water. Okay. <laughs> they're all in it. Oh, they're right into the pit as Kerry is getting a fair bit of work done. We'll see who's going to be out to actually take down the Baron. This oh! eventually falls, but Yoshik steals the Baron away. But at what cost? Yeah, well, maybe the game LS is deft. He tries to QSS, but he's not going to be able to get that one done. And Ghost, although he's slowed, he's still going to be able to grab that kill. Chobi on the run once again. <laughs> and uh, oh, no. can he do it? Can he do it, gentlemen? Chovy against the wall. One versus three. The oh. spear is going to connect. The Edge of Night came back off cooldown, but he's still going to die. That's the ace. In position. Oh. Try and kill oh. anyone who... Headbutt pulverized. Goodbye, Carrier. Death tries to get some damage across. But... Okay. Can he actually one, sh one shot for Kyoshik is the question. As, uh, yeah. Oh, come ace. out. You know, leave, leave him alone, man. This is so... I don't, I don't, I don't really have words to describe how one-sided this is, gentlemen. As uh, Doran, he's getting chunks. Yeah, while Nuggery is just casual, he's really not doing the damage they really want. Face breaker on a barrel, but uh -oh. barrel likes that one. As, uh, oh oh man! God, oh. Tossed around like a rag doll. Is now Pyoshik's in trouble. Brent oh. has to slow oh. down the spear. Oh. Oh. It's gonna connect, and Canyon getting right underneath this turret. Barrel's gonna taxi Doran into his fountain. Ocean Drake still going to win this game. Exactly right. Ocean Soul has been confirmed. And Dom One, they don't lose health bars. 
DRX, though, they may lose a couple more before we end this game. But no, game two is over. Darmwon moved to match point here in this final. And for 2020, it's looking like, once again, three zeros. It is really looking like Damwon are about to put lights out on DRX. They are so dominating here in this finals. It looks like even though DRX is getting what they would hope to happen, which is Chovy getting super big, super advantages, nothing is working out for them. The bot lane is just getting gapped. The top lane in game number two just fell really far behind, and we, we expect that. Yeah. yeah. And, and also, yeah, you can say. Yeah, I mean, the, the draft is, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. I mean, eggs or something. Yeah. <laughs> like, Oh! oh, is he gonna do it? Oh, finally! Yes! 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 You there did it! Go. <laughs> you made it, Ellis! <laughs> All right, Ghost Draven as well. So we get Ghost Callista, definitely one of the champions that he was known for, but he was a Draven player, like you were talking about. I feel like it was Ghost and Kramer. Oh, man. oh, I'm so excited. And the Shen gonna be locked in here for Doran. So it will be the Aurelia in the mid lane. We're relying on. Uh, this Lilia for all of our magic damage, which is absolutely fine. Sent win rate. And he played this champion most of the time on BBQ as Death taking so much damage here. Oh no. Oh. Walks back. That's dangerous. Flash forward. Spear comes down. I've seen uh -oh. this movie before, guys. Yeah, well, like Death actually. Oh! Yeah, there is the stun comes through. Good yeah. double play back as Death in a bit of trouble, but those Ninja Tabis actually working out for him. As Beryl has to back away and is having. A lot of good situation and... Whoa, there's the flash. Ah, oh. uh, gonna get missed by the spear. That might keep him alive as he grabs oh! the shield. The extra shield from the Sand United. He's even itemizing a little bit of a Build-A-Bear workshop. Well, Nogari looks for the stun, gets it, oh. and uh, that's a very dead li Lilia. Doesn't really want to be taking uh, this. Spear's gonna land on the carrier. In goes Showmaker. Gets into his trap. Goshen's no, gonna get executed. No. And it's gonna be Akali that locks down oh. the dragon. There's the perfect execution. I love Whoa, watching this guy's Akali. Quadra kill and Chovy's like, nah, I'm back to the mid lane. Um, <laughs> we Chobie done here, boys. Again, man. <laughs> no way. Oh no. Uh, we can confirm that even though they didn't participate in the playoffs, they are still just way better than everyone else. I mean, I... just look at how they build up the structure. The game was already over when Showmaker yeah. landed on Koshik. And Showmaker goes in on a Piotrick, 34 HP remaining on oh. the Dragon. Oh. Showmaker goes in. Oh! And it, Chobi, I mean, there's nothing you can do in that team fight. No, Chovy! Oh, oh, oh. oh, okay, that was a bit sexy. Oh. That's a flash. Vanguard's Edge not going to do anything. Nogari's going to get slowed for a little while, but he's... Well, let's see whether Nogari's going to be able to survive this one. He will have a Q available with a lot of rage. See whether he can at least take someone with him. Looks like the answer's no, is Nogari's... Sorry, Chovy. So, some oh, stats going There's on the there. flash forward from Beryl. Is, that's a good Lantern, so Death is going to survive for the moment. Beryl getting taken down very, very low. It's a one for one so far. There's Pyoshik getting dove on by Showmaker. Oh! And there it is. Perfect execution, and it is exactly Chobie. where he can get one of these kills. I mean, he's just trying to do everything he can. I mean, his CS is pretty good. <laughs> he does have 200. Yeah, there we are. Oh, oh no. walks into it. Yeah, that's not what you want. Well, disaster. <laughs> We'll see whether he can Land find it here on the show. So, the stun. final exactly chance. Right. Vanguard's Edge does a fair bit of damage there as in goes Dora. Oh, right oh. There. oh God. God. Evaporation of the Aurelia, and now the rest of Dom want to get a turn up. Doran, oh, are they going to get oh. the kill to Ghost? They do. The Adoration oh. stack. Man. Must have. As Beryl's going to face check, and uh, he's going to come out better for it as he puts up his shield as well. Def tries to get the burst at the end, isn't able to do so. One. You know, honestly, I, well, we, I mean, we see the stun, co stun come in here. Ghost, not able to get the kill, didn't really matter. Showmaker hops over, gets it for his team. And then right here, perfect execution on to that Lilia. Really nice spear by Canyon. He's really making up for the missed ones from earlier. Yeah. Earlier games, yeah. But it doesn't matter. I mean... The way how they take the win is also really great for Damon Gaming is because of like mostly them having like so many so many ways to win. Yeah. 773 gold. So I told a lie, it wasn't 600, it was a bit more than that. As you can see, Nuclear definitely very happy about that one.
Oh, I was waiting for you, Showmaker. I knew that you were going to carry this game. <laughs> what he said! <laughs> Woo! Everyone knew it! That's all we were talking about, is Beryl's going to get caught out, put inside the oh. box, and Pantheon doesn't like being inside boxes. Choby's so far away from this. The Baron down to 4,000 health. Derek's going to get spotted out. Koshik executed as the Whirling Death flies past Doran. Down to half health. Good hook. He's going to land on the barrel, but he mitigates all of the damage. At least for the majority of the time. Shan also going to fall down. And uh, Carrier, not going to avoid the damage there from Showmaker, but does move himself out of the way. Five point strike comes in. Double kill for the Nidalee as Choby underneath his turret. Showmaker dives after him. Gives him the old Teemo thumbs up. And he'll get out of there just fine. Fast APM. This inhibitor soon to follow. DRX getting spread too thin. That's a good hook to land on the canyon. Played back, but immediately goes golden. Carrier could be in trouble. As now Showmaker diving into the mix. It is going to be a dead Nidalee, but Nuggery, he's trying to get on in here. Barrel, very, very Chobi? low. But look at the AoE. Chomi with a double kill already. There's Nuggery trying to get on top of Death, and he will execute the Callista, but Chovy still fighting this one out. That's another one for a triple kill. Can he find the Quadra? The answer's not quite yet. As Chovy gets on forward, Doran had teleported into this fight, and Chovy's still desperately trying to keep DRX in this series. It can be the game. Yeah, they're spotted immediately. Uh, this is called a Hail Mary, gentlemen. As Doran does have Stand United, Showmaker moving over towards the side. As nice. There's the man drop to get Beryl all the way in there, but that's a brilliant hook to predict. Oh, oh, he is so strong. Oh my god, Gojic now having to deal with a big crocodile, oh. but Chobi oh. is still here, able to get work done. Deft at half health. There are super minions in the base, but DRX are potentially winning a fight. As uh, you can see Canyon trying to get on forward. This is Noggery trying to win the game by himself. DRX looking to try and turn because they knew the backs were going to get stopped. Draven? The flash out for Dev as Draven picks up the kill onto the Shannon. Noggery oh. is going to be able to take down these Nexus turrets. Joby wanting to do something off the back end of this one, but I don't think he's going to be able to stop this Croc from taking down the Nexus and getting Dom one to Worlds in first seed in three games to zero. Noggery. Stop playing with your food, gentlemen. He is going to be able to take down this Nexus eventually. Choby also going to be taken off the board. Def, he's just going to throw himself away. And the Nexus is going to go down for the final time here. And congratulations to Darmon for the first time. One of our teams promoted from the Challengers career is going to be your LCK champion for summer for 2020. Well, the game <laughs> got the fade. And Damwon are very ecstatic. By the way, we have only one vote for. Uh, yeah, yeah, you guys have the finals. I didn't right? know how to how to go about this, by the way. So I just handed you a paper with uh, who well, I I'm, thought. I'm, so I'm we, all about recency bias. So Shotmaker. Uh, no, I mean we have only one vote. I know. From I know. Us, so right? I'm, putting, and I'm putting my vote towards. Our vote. How about you be the the, the breaker? Yeah, I mean, because I, I want to vote for Ghost. I'm Barrel. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm actually Ghost too. Um, if I was being serious, I think Ghost had one of the best series of his life. Yeah, I think so. So we are gonna you go guys for are Ghost. Just Tyler one fanboy. Ghost. <laughs> <laughs> we vote for Ghost. Yeah. Thank you. Perfect. Nailed it. Incredible stuff. This team is just shaping up to be so incredibly strong, and for some of the best teams in the world. Especially if you look back to like SKT, uh, years past when they were basically unstoppable. It was because you didn't know, when you go into a team fight, you don't know who to kill. Yeah. Because all of them are dangerous. Every single player on the team. That's what makes a great team. And Darmon, especially in what they demonstrated here today, are exactly that. I mean, their win condition was not only their top side. Yeah. Their bolt lane could carry. Their mid lane could carry, and their top side also. But their jungle can carry too. I mean, we saw Canyon get the LCK first pentakill this year. So, yeah. And even Beryl, the guy does too much damage for a support player. <sighs> oh, man. Gen G are a team that weren't necessarily able to stand yeah. up to the pressure recently. But congratulations to Darmon. They will hoist the LCK trophy for 2020 summer, and they get to do it from home, which they is do. pretty cool. Well, we'll see how they fare in a couple of weeks when Worlds kicks off.
And if Dom Juan can retain their form, they're going to be very scary and go into the tournament as one of the favorites. Yeah, for they the also, entire thing. Oh, they also don't have to travel very far because, of course, you know, China yeah, is just a hop over zone, the pond. Basically. Yep. Yeah. So there shouldn't be any jet lag. An adjustment isn't quite as uh, stark between, you know, Korea and China. Yeah. Yes, the food changes a little bit. There's not quite as much kimchi, but it's basically the same. <laughs> I mean, it, it <laughs> doesn't know, it's, matter. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, all the Korean teams, they bring uh, the Yo, yeah, Korean they package. Right, yeah, that's food. true. That's yeah. true. So it doesn't matter. And also every Chinese team has two Koreans on it.